What if the rough stone you found in the ground, inherited from a relative, or bought cheaply at a market, is actually a real diamond worth thousands of dollars? Or what if it's just an ordinary stone that looks convincing but has no real value? Uh, many people around the world ask the same question every day. How can I tell if my rough diamond is real or fake at home without special tools? Initial tools. In this article, you will discover simple, realistic, and practical methods that help you make a first judgment before going to a professional gemologist. Tash, why identifying a rough diamond matters. Rough diamonds do not look like shiny jewelry stones. They often appear dull, dirty, and unremarkable. Because of this, real diamonds are frequently mistaken for quartz, crystal, or other common minerals. Correct identification can save you from being scammed, help you recognize a valuable stone, prevent you from selling a diamond for almost nothing, give you confidence before professional testing. Important warning, before you start, home tests do not replace professional laboratory analysis. However, they are excellent first step filters to know whether your stone is worth further examination. If a stone fails several of these tests, it is very likely not a real diamond. One, visual inspection, the first clue. A real rough diamond usually has sharp natural edges, an oily or greasy surface appearance, a crystal shape, often octahedral or irregular but angular, no rounded edges like river stones. Fake stones such as quartz often look too smooth, glassy, rounded or polished by nature. Tip, real diamonds rarely look perfect, but they look hard and sharp. Nashar 2, transparency test. Can you see through it? Most real rough diamonds are not fully transparent. Hold the stone under a strong light. If you can clearly see through it like glass, likely fake. If it looks cloudy, milky, or slightly translucent, possible diamond. Many fake stones look too clear to be natural diamonds. Number three, scratch test. Use with caution. Diamonds are extremely hard, but this test must be done carefully. Try scratching a piece of normal glass. A real diamond can scratch glass easily. If the stone cannot scratch glass, not a diamond. Warning. This test may damage valuable stones. Use only if you accept the risk. Number hubber four, density test. Weight matters. Diamonds are heavy for their size. Compare your stone with another stone of similar size. If your stone feels surprisingly light, likely fake. If it feels solid and heavy, more promising. Quartz and glass are noticeably lighter than diamonds. If five, heat resistance test. Diamonds can handle extreme heat. Heat the stone for a few seconds, drop it into cold water. If the stone cracks or breaks, fake. If nothing happens, possible diamond. Fake stones often shatter due to sudden temperature change. Scherf 6. Surface marks and wear. Real diamonds do not scratch easily, maintain sharp edges over time. Fake stones show surface scratches, edges wear down naturally. Examine the stone with a magnifying glass if possible. 7. Common stones mistaken for diamonds. Many people confuse diamonds with quartz, calcite, zircon, glass, crystal. These stones may look convincing, but fail multiple tests listed above. Final verdict, is your rough diamond real or fake? If your stone has sharp edges, feels heavy, scratches glass, resists heat, is not fully transparent, there is a real possibility it could be a diamond. However, the only 100% reliable con confirmation comes from a certified gemologist or laboratory testing. Conclusion. Learning how to tell if a rough diamond is real or fake at home gives you power, awareness, and protection. While home tests are not perfect, they help you avoid false hope and obvious scams. Before you throw that stone away, before you sell it cheaply, make sure you test it wisely. That ordinary-looking rock might be extraordinary.